What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Coffee Pod. My name is Chishi Zed. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Aisha Curry is at it again. Um, Twitter reacts to Aisha Curry pretending to take off her wedding ring during an episode of Girl Chat. Poor Steph is what everybody is saying. So I can't actually play the full video for you guys right here, but it's short and not really much to see so there's a guy that comes out shirtless black guy that comes out you know um showing off the muscles and he has a platter of drinks and he's bringing it to the ladies it's the talk show type thing and aisha curry when she notices the man starts pretending to take a ring off um jokingly like hey he's attractive i want to take the ring off you know trying to be funny um but here's the problem with that is Maybe if this was the first time she pretended like she wanted to be single or hinted that she missed being single and not being married to um, a talented athlete, then people probably wouldn't have reacted that way, right? In the past, she said things like, oh, I miss the attention that I used to get from men. And, you know, we weren't really surprised over here because we drink coffee. We know women love attention, right? They can't help, they love attention. And she can't stand the fact that she's not getting that type of attention anymore. And so the whole taking the ring off your finger and pretend to do that, people saw that as a disrespect. And of course they would because she's kind of, you know, said some off the wall stuff in regards to her marriage and not paying his stuff in the very best light. There's other stuff like, oh, and we're about to read the comments. We're about to read the comments right now. There's other stuff like her posing nude, right? And trying to f seek attention and validation in that way. Let's check out some of these comments and see what the people have to say. One second. First comment reads, at this point, you have to feel sorry for Steph Curry. Aisha has already embarrassed him multiple times. Yes, she has. But last night, she took it up a notch by flirting with another man. Prayers up for Steph. I don't know if there was actually flirting going on in the official video. You guys can go check it out. It might be on What's Brewing, our page on Instagram. You can go check out. If it's not, I'll make sure it's on there. So yeah, go over and Check out and see the, the full video on there. Another comment here reads, Ain't no way Aisha Curry trying to take off her ring on live television with the crying emoji. Not even Steph Curry is safe. You know what's crazy, man? I don't know if I'm going to play this. Uh, uh, nah, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Well, I don't want to change the subject because I might do a different video on it. But it's never enough, right? If, if it's never enough for that woman, then it's just never enough. I mean, we, we see that over and over again with particular women. Now the comment here says, you can win five championships, make hundreds of millions of dollars, tone muscles, president and the ex-president of the country knows you, all the girls want you all around, LeBron is jealous of your game, but you still can't satisfy Aisha Curry. Mercy. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Drink the coffee, this man said. <laughs> Someone else responded to that that dude and said, poor Steph, he never beating them. Allegations. The crying emoji. Here's another comment that says, I don't like Steph Curry, but he deserves better than Aisha. What the F is she thinking? So that was it, man. That's all the comments we have on this topic. I don't know why she keeps playing with this man like that. You would think because of what's happened in the past, or maybe she just doesn't care. Maybe she just doesn't care. Hopefully she stops embarrassing the man because it's not looking good. It's not looking good. But as always, man, I'm curious. What do you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Listen, I appreciate you for checking out yet another episode of The Coffee Pod. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.